Hello, uh, here I am. I am working on my Union Troops, got them all finished, and now I am finishing up the uh, command stands by putting uh, flags on them. So each uh, unit for unions typically have the regimental flag and then the, the colors, um, the Union colors that they have. So I am going to show you how to hand paint uh, the regimental flag, just your kind of standard, typical um, regimental flag for the Union. There was lots of variations, even though they were fairly standardized. Um, so, but um, each company, they had a lot of different companies making uh, these flags, so they always kind of varied a bit. So, first thing I'm going to do is start off with a yellow and just come in and just paint the edge. If you can hold that. And this just kind of signifies, signifies the tassels that you find. The, uh, the next thing to get mean, let's hit this a little bit more at an angle and see if I can get a better shot there, it is a little bit of white. And you're going to paint the bald eagle's head. And then put a couple squiggles down there for the tail. Next thing you're going to need is the brown. And the brown is pretty simple. All you're going to do is just paint kind of a an upside down W or a U. That gives you your, your eagle shape. And then you're going to come in with the red. And underneath of these, they often had um, some a little banner that had the the name so a u shape with two little um, things off to the edge if you want sometimes it even had a banner coming out of the mouth of the eagle you can do that if you like last thing is the stars above I think there's like 34, but obviously I'm not going to count 34 stars. So there you go. That is how I do the regimental flags. Uh, I There's plenty of paper ones you can buy, but I just really prefer the look of a hand-painted flag, particularly with the hand-painted hand -painted miniatures. So hope that was helpful for you. And... Yeah.